No, let's talk First about date. that story. Trekkie. Trekkie River. Okay, so... Snakey business. Snakey business, part one. So basically, I was... I somehow got her to follow me down the river fly fishing. And so I was right. trying to make it as palatable as possible. And I had seen a snake before and like kind of told her about it. I think I told you about First it. First of all, Matthew's probably either wearing waders or wading boots and wading socks. This was the summer before I owned any of that stuff. So I'm in Chacos. Yeah, that's it. Barefoot. Right. In my Chacos. So literally behind me, I hear, ouch, ouch, <laughs> ouch, ouch, like the whole time. So I grab this, I think I had a walking stick or something. Probably. And so I grab this stick and I see. We saw a snake. We saw a snake. We saw a snake and first. So I was like, oh man, this is not working out. And it's super high. I think the water was really high. Mm-hmm. So the next snake, I saw it. And I grabbed this stick that was like kind of like a walking stick. And I literally wedged it halfway under the snake. Well, the snake coils. You like put the stick down. Snake starts to kind of coil, coil around, around it. your stick. And so I was like, I just got to like, get rid whoa, of this whoa, thing. Babe, so we're walking there. downstream. I'm not right. even looking at anything else. You're right. behind me like three right. or four feet. And so I literally just toss it into the middle of the river. Right. <laughs> and then as we look up to see it land... Like snake we didn't even flying know. through the air, flying through the air. It was probably four feet from landing in a commercial rafting boat. No, like <laughs> for real, it landed I think with right like in the water. Four wa- women and a guide, and everyone's and- just like, "What was that?" And we're like, "They're like, where did you come from? Was that a snake? <laughs> was, like, was that a snake? It was hilarious." Could so, a part of me to this day kind of wishes I threw it in the boat because that would have been just mayhem. Yes, if you threw if you're on a rafting trip. That would have been so scary They're for just everybody. Bailing and we're like, sorry, we didn't mean to throw a snake in your boat, <laughs> but it happened. It'd be hilarious. We survived. So we survived. We survived. I'm assuming the snake survived. Yeah. But that was uh, that was a fun time. Since then, you're kind of outfitted. You've got. Actually, I told Dr. Morrissey. I showed him your fish. Duh. The it, big brown. Yeah. That's the story you need to tell. To which next. classic Dr. Morrissey replied, "Oh man." What a fish. He actually loves, you know, he loves it. He's like, whoa, what a fish. Did I tell you about two months ago? When He's I caught like, did I tell you about tarpon? my huge fish? Exactly. He just pound has tarpon. to one-up me. I know. But he... 100 pounds? 100 pounds? 100 pound tarpon. On a I weigh like maybe 20 more pounds than that fish. Yeah. In your bra. <laughs> <laughs> my license, my, my driver's license says 120 is my yeah, goal. Yeah, I know. So it's a monster fish. 